Hi guys, if you're trying to format your drive and then you get this message Windows cannot format this drive, quit any disk utility or other program that is using this drive, then I'm gonna show you how to solve this problem so that you would be able to format this drive. This is as a consequence of another video that I was making and I couldn't format this drive. So I found a way around it to do it. So you go here in the windows and then you type system. When you type system, then this thing appears system control panel, then click on it. And then go in this right corner and click on change settings. On the change settings, then go to advanced. On the advanced, then you go to settings. On the settings, then you go to again advanced. In the advanced, then you go to change. In the changed, you can see virtual memory. On the virtual memory, automatically manage paging file sizes for all drives untick this and then no paging file so then click on set then gives you this message if you disable the paging file or set the initial size to less than 400 megabytes and a system error occurs windows might not record details that could help to identify the problem do you want to continue then you say yes i want to continue so remember you did these changes Make a record of your changes or come back and watch this video. Then you know what changes you made. And then remember, after you formatted that drive, come back and uh, revert back the changes to the original settings. For, but for now, click after the set that you've done. Click OK. The changes you have made require you to restore your computer before they can be affected. So then click OK. Then click Apply. Then click OK. Okay, then click OK. It says, do you want to restart now? Before doing that, uh, close all your programs. Close this. Okay, close that, close everything. And then click on the restart button. After restart is completed, then go back to your drive that you want it to format right click click on format and then click start you should be aware that everything in that file for drive would be deleted then click ok then click yes so this still didn't solve the problem then we have to try another method